Hey everybody, Kevin Barnett back here in the Carmine 3D studio. Today we'll give you five things you can make or modify for the golf community. You don't have to like golf to understand that it is a marketplace rich with opportunity for you, the CNC owner. So much passion, so much money in that community, and they love gadgetry. So let's get you making some great stuff, developing new clientele, and making some money. Number one item on the list is a no-brainer, ball markers. We recently did a coin project and this is exactly the same idea. These are markers you use to mark your ball on the fairway with a bigger one or on the green with a smaller one. People carry multiples of these in their bag. There are tons of different designs and opportunities here for you. With MC Etcher, you can buy a pack of 10 for $10. Plain steel ball markers, already pre-cut, already polished. Go ahead and chuck up the MC at your 120 or 90 degree and you're all set making custom designs. Go ahead and add enamel or epoxy fills, experiment with materials, buy a sheet of metal and you can rep these things right out whether you own a Nomad or one of our Shapeoko machines. Ball marker within a ball marker is something that absolutely exists and you can exploit as well. There are excellent margin opportunities here. With a dollar, you could turn it into five or seven dollars. With five dollars, you can turn it into as much as $45. You'll have to set your own price point that is in line with your clientele and also your level of design and creation. Having the right clients and separating yourself from the competition is key. With several of these items, you can get an order from a course, a tournament, or a promoter. Instead of making your sale one at a time, all of a sudden you're selling 50, 100, or 200 at a time now you have a real business. Number two is bag tags. Now here you can go a whole bunch of different directions. People love to hang stuff off their bags, especially if you make it beautiful. I made this one out of a composite walnut piece and an Aston Martin design that I already had. This idea can be taken well outside of the golf arena. You can take it to just regular travel. Aluminum, brass, copper, all kinds of different treatments here, all manner of wood and plastics. Be creative, make some bag tags, make some money. On to number three, and that's divot forks, either simple or complex. Let's start with the simple. You can make this any shape you would like, as long as it has the forks on the end to go ahead and pull those divots up when you hit the green with your excellent approach shot. You can go ahead and mimic whatever you'd like with the rest. This happens to have three different functions. It is a divot tool, it holds the ball marker with a magnet that's inlaid there, and it also, yeah, it's a beer bottle opener because that's what a lot of people do is drink and golf. You can get crazy with the shapes, the materials, the methods. There's nothing you can't do with this simple flat tool. Doesn't take a whole lot of machining prowess to produce something pretty cool. With this divot tool, you might notice its similarity to a knife go ahead and treat it as such. People make tons of money with custom knives. This is just another opportunity to take that same form factor and for you to take it as deep as you want. Start making scales for either side of this tool. Disassemble it, utilize the mechanism that's available for four to six dollars and add on to it. Go ahead and machine away the knurling on this particular model and create a flat area for you to polish and then engrave. There is so much possibility in this project. This one, just like the simpler version, contains a magnet for a ball marker. You can inlay one with one of your custom markers and now you're selling two items instead of one. Your ability to develop new customers and nurture existing relationships is gonna be critical to your success as a CNC business owner. Keep bringing them new ideas. Keep showing them something that they haven't seen before. A, B, C, always be creating. Number four, trophies, awards, plaques, and commemorative items. I'm not talking about competing with your local trophy shop. I'm talking about developing a relationship with your local course or a couple of local courses that you're going to provide something unique. Golf courses run a wide variety of events and these people are dying to give out something different than the same old garbage they've had for years. We just did a custom putter project with a putter that you wanted to play with. There's no reason you can't make a putter that is intended to be a trophy. You don't have to worry about the weight. You can experiment with the shape and the materials on the head by a shaft and a grip, which are both inexpensive. And all of a sudden you're giving out something that's pretty cool. To number five, 
modifying and marking golf clubs, particularly putters. Put people's names on them, as simple as that, onto nearly any putter in existence with MC Etcher or the 501-502 PCB engravers. This also works in concert with the award side of things with basic blade putters. I see a lot of synergy between number four and number five. Those are my top five areas to explore in the golf realm. If you have other ideas, put them in the comments below. Let's add to the list. Let's continue to give you different things that you can make where you can make money, give gifts, and enjoy the CNC process. We'll be back again here in the studio with more information, ideas, and inspiration.